Hi everybody, I am back. I am here to do a, these are a few of my favorite things video. Um, it's not really the very end of a month or the beginning of the month, so I'm not going to put a month with it. It's just some of the things I've been loving and basically I can't live without um, different products that I've just like, I've either recently purchased or I have just keep right rebuying and rebuying because I love them so much. So I just wanted I to go ahead those. and just get started on some things that I'm loving. I have some makeup products. I have a nail product. Um, I have a bath product and I have some jewelry, which is kind of weird, but I just been loving it and I thought I'd share it. So let me go ahead and just get started. Um, all these products are vegan, so um, that's just something to keep in mind when if you're watching this for a vegan reason, all my products here are vegan. So um, something to keep in mind. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and just start. Um, something I've really been loving is the Primer Hard Candy Sheer Envy Primer. And um, the only thing I don't like about this is that um, it's only available through Walmart and I don't shop at Walmart. So you can either go online and buy this or um, I've had people that I know that shop at Walmart. They'll be like, you know, do I, you need anything? And I'll just tell them to pick me this up and I'll so, pay for it. Yeah, so I think it's $8. Yeah, I'm sure you've seen previews uh, or reviews on this before. Um, I really just like this primer. I used the e.l.f. primer, um, but um, it's very similar. This is definitely a lot thicker, um, but it just, it's, I just really like it. I can't tell you that it definitely keeps my makeup on longer or it smooths over my skin real well. It just makes my skin feel good. I love the way it feels when I apply it. Um, I just, I don't know if it's real or not, but I feel like it sets my makeup really nice, um, prepares my skin really nice Loving for makeup. the primer from Hard Candy. Um, another thing I'm loving, yes to cucumbers, fa facial towels. I do love these so much just because... Um, what I do is I use these every night. I don't wash my face. I'm not a, the best face washer in the um, world. I there's times where I'm just so tired I can't get myself to you know do this um, to go through my you know nighttime. These regimen. are perfect, and the reason why is because it stays on here. Um, Gently white face and neck to cleanse and rid skin of impurities and makeup. Don't even think about rinsing. No need. You're clean. You're nourished. You're looking. You're good looking. Now that's the thing I love about this because if you like use Elf makeup wipes, um, they leave a greasy feel to your skin. And like even when you wipe off your makeup, you have to go wash your skin. Like there's just no way that you can really just like leave that on there. It's, it actually feels worse than the makeup being on there. Um, where this makes you feel like it's clean. So on those nights where I don't want to wash my face, uh, that's fine because, you know, this pretty much gets it all. And when I do go wash my face afterwards, there's little to mi very minimal amount of makeup left, you know, when I wash my face. So it is really a good product. Um, I just stocked up on these. Now, I don't know what this means, but at Walgreens, um, I noticed it was like a last chance sale on them. And they're usually $5.99 and they were $3.99. So I asked the cosmetic lady if that means that if it, since it says last chance that they were discontinuing the product. She said yes. But at other stores when I see this, I don't see anything else saying that it's like a last chance or that it's being discontinued and they're being stocked. So I'm assuming they're not. I don't know why Walgreens, I don't know, maybe Walgreens is just going to stop carrying them and other stores are. But what was sweet was she told me that she's like, oh, I have coupons for um, yes to cucumbers anyway. I'm like, that's awesome. And I love our cosmetic lady in Walgreens. She is like super awesome. And I always go to her because she always has all the best coupons and everything like that. Um, but anyway, she said she had a coupon for $3 off. And I'm like, what? I had bought five, I think five or six of these. They were 99 cents each. I was on cloud nine when I got these because like I said, they're like a holy grail to me. They're my ultimate face wipes. I love them so much. And when she said that, I was just all about it. So I took everything they had in stock <laughs> and um, bought a whole bunch of them just because I love them that much. So if you're looking for a good makeup remover wipe and sometimes you don't have the energy or the ability to go wash your face afterwards, these are absolutely perfect. That was a long story about makeup wipes, but whatever. We all know I like to talk about stuff. Another product that I have that I can't live without, like full on doubt, I cannot live without, is the Urban Decay D Slick Oil Control Makeup Setting Spray. And I absolutely, I mean, 
Oh, I just love, love, love this product. In fact, I don't want to do my makeup if I don't have this product with me. Um, I bought this a while ago. I bought my first bottle a while ago, and I loved it. Ran out of it. It is an expensive product. It's $29, and I buy mine at Ulta. Um, sometimes I'll take, I, we don't have a Sephora around me, so sometimes I take a trip and I go to Sephora and I pick it up or whatever, but um, you can also get them online. Um, but I didn't buy one for a while after my first one ran out because it was $29 basically. And I just don't have very high end expensive pr um, face products, things like that. Um, so I didn't really get it. Well, then I got it again as a gift from someone and I fell in love with it all over again. And now I'm just like, there's no point in doing my makeup if I don't have this because it keeps my makeup on so well. I very rarely have to um, de-oil. Most time I have to de-oil is about once or twice a day. And that's on a high humidity kind of day where I've been outside a lot. Then I'll have to, but during the winter months, there was days where I literally never had a de-oil and I had no shine to my skin. It is the best product. Now I have given a bottle to my sister and she's like, eh, I can see why you like it, but it's not that great. I sorry it's just the best product to me so it's definitely a relative situation but I I love it I spray it on about do like three little spritz before my makeup and then I do all my makeup and then I do three more spritz after my makeup and it does a flawless wonderful job absolutely love this product and I will never go again say hey I don't have you know well I should really save money this month I shouldn't buy it. no I'll be buying this always um another product I'm loving We'll kind of stay in the makeup area. This I actually just started using this week, but I purchased this. Man, I don't remember how long ago. It is the Elf Pigment Eyeshadow. And it won't focus on it. There it goes. And it is in these tiny little sticker. I can't read it, but you guys saw it. Let's see. What does it say? Um, I have my glasses on. Holy crap. Okay, I can't, I cannot read the first word of this. It starts with an I. It might be innocent. I agree. I don't have my glasses on. I can't read it. Um, iridescent. I agree. I don't know. But what it is, it has like this blue, pink, kind of purple iridescence to it. It is such a pretty color. I absolutely just love it now. Okay, so there it is. It's hard to tell. Here's my finger. See how it has an iridescent, almost like a pink purple color to it? It is so pretty. I absolutely, I just love, love, love this product. So if you're looking for like a pretty inner corner eye color um, or for a pretty, like a nice color, I don't know. I just, I'm loving that color. So. You're, that's a fun color to look into, definitely. Um, I know I've mentioned this a million times as well, but I just want to let you guys know just one more. Um, the Elf, Elf, you can't read it because it is all smeared off, um, but it's the Elf Mineral Eyeshadow Primer. This is another item that is just like an ultimate favorite of mine. I'm just in love with it. It comes with a little doe foot. I actually, just so you know too, as a tip, if you are running low like I am, like as you can probably see, there's nothing left in this thing. Um, there was a little plastic insert in here right at the top and I popped it out one day and I was able to get a lot more hidden product that was underneath right at the top here and um, use that. So it's, you know, if you are really low on this and you haven't popped that little insert out yet, try that and you might get a little bit more product because that lasted me like another two weeks, I think, just with that little bit of product. Now I have another makeup thing. This is not from e.l.f. Surprise, surprise. This is actually the Aldi brand Lacura. Um, it doesn't have the color on it, but it does have the number 402 on it, as you can see. Um, so I don't know what color it is, but if you're looking for it, it's number 402. I think it's like a deep red or something like that. But it is just an awesome, awesome color. Now, I have not freshened up my makeup. Reason being is because I was going to talk about this. I put this with my primer, my e.l.f. Mineral, uh, my e.l.f. lip primer that I talked about in my other videos. I put that on today. No lip liner. Nothing else. I put this on 
and it doesn't feather for some reason, which my lips get a lot of feathering and I did not get any, I don't get feathering with this lipstick and it stays on. I have not reapplied. I have not done anything to my lips. Like literally I have eaten lunch, breakfast, I've had drinks. I mean, it's crazy and it's been on for like eight hours, well, almost nine hours. So love this lipstick. I love the color. Um, obviously it's a little bit, um, of a different color now. Actually, I'll just kind of touch it up. So you can kind of see I have no mirror. So I'm literally doing this on my computer screen. <laughs> okay, hopefully I don't look like a crack or okay. So you can see there's obviously a lip color difference. Um but that's the the deepness of it, but it is just, the, it's a great lipstick for a cheap price at Aldi's. Like, it's just this a, a long time ago. It is, I, I like e.l.f. Um, nail polish. I do like e.l.f. nail polish, and I use e.l.f. nail polish every once in a while. Um, I had bought this color, which is the Coral. I can't get it. There it is. You can kind of see it. So this is Coral. Let me kind of get this close to the color. As you can see, if you can, I don't know, but it has like this iridescent swirl in it with the coral. And I'm going to tell you, it's like a gold iridescent color. It is, I put this on my nails about three weeks ago and I got so many compliments on this color. It has such a nice summery color to it and I just love the gold iridescence in it. It was so pretty and I got so many compliments on it. So I'm absolutely in love with this color. So if you go to e.l.f. and it's a dollar. If you go to e.l.f. and you get um, nail polish, definitely try out the coral. Love that color. The Pure um, Castile Soap from um, Dr. Broner's Magic Soaps. And I've seen other reviews on this before. Um, in fact, I got the idea to purchase this from um, Veggie Beauty. And she had suggested it. And I saw it at Old Time, so I picked up one. And I fell in love with it to a point that it is now empty. And I haven't gotten out there to repurchase it again, which I am upset about. But one thing I want to talk about, first of all, I love this for my skin. It washed my body really well. Um, a little goes a long way. But what I love the most about it is that it is the best brush cleaner I have ever used, ever, in all brush cleaner life. This makes it so easy. When you put your makeup brushes in the, with this, it, the makeup just comes out and there's really less um, effort. The jewelry awesome. things I want to talk about, first of all, you might have seen this in a video. I think I got a couple of compliments on this, on, on comments on this. Um, but it is a necklace and I've been wearing it to death. It is... This little necklace, it is like an elf, uh, elf, I have elf on the mind. Um, it is an owl necklace. And I don't know if you can tell really well. It has like rhinestone eyes and rhinestone little body. And I love how it's sitting on a little stick. And it comes on this little chain. And I actually got this at um, Charming Charlie's. But I wear this at least once a week. I'm just in love with it. It goes with everything that I feel like I wear. And it's just the cutest necklace ever. I get so many compliments on it. And I just love it. And I got it at Charming Charlie's for clearance. I don't know if they still have it because it was on clearance. But I absolutely love this necklace. And then the last thing I want to show you are bracelets. And these bracelets I got at Shopco. And they're real stone bracelets. And they're um, the slide bracelets where you take it and go like this and you have your bracelet and um, what I did I got three bracelets one I have on right now and it's like a onyx bracelet then I have this nice purple one and then I have a green one and I do believe these still at Shopco's if you have a Shopco by you I do believe that they still have um, these out there because I've seen them there they're really heavy um, and they are really sturdy and durable. I wear this one, this black one, almost every single day because I almost every outfit I have has black in it. I just, I love these bracelets. They're so sturdy and so nice and I just absolutely love them. And so, yeah, I've been another just favorite jewelry product that I had. So anyway, that is it. Thank you again for watching. Thanks for your support and um, I will see you guys soon. Bye.